Hi boys and girls, we're in lesson 19. This is our second decodable reader story. It's called Boat Rides and it's in our journeys, unit 4, decodable reader. And it's called Boat Rides because it's all about boat rides. There's some sailboats. There are some bit sailboats. This is a flat boat. This is, these are rafts. See what else we have going here. There's a rowboat. Man, that's big. That's a big rowboat. And there's a cruise ship. So let's, um, I'll read it to you first and then we'll look at some words and then we'll read it together. Okay, while I'm reading it, look and at the words and at the pictures because you can learn a lot that way. Are you ready? Boat rides. Is it time for a ride? A boat ride can be so much fun. This boat has sails as white as snow. Okay, these are the sails and they are white. The big white sails make the boat go. Wind blows and fills the sails. And it's going really fast. Strong winds can make the boat go fast. It is fun to sail, but you must stay safe. You need a life vest. If these kids get knocked out of the boat, don't worry. These life vests will keep them from sinking. Really, they should have had the mom and dad wearing them too. This flat boat has no sails. It is slow. You use a pole to make it float. So the water must not be that deep if you're, you know, having a pole to drag it across the riverbed. Anyway, it can carry loads down this stream. Now they're talking about this boat. This boat is a raft. It is fun to ride fast on white waves. Hats and life vests help keep this ride safe. So where you see all this white water, it's moving very quickly and they're probably laughing in glee as they go down those rapids. Okay, so there's the little rowboat and the big rowboat. This boat has no sail. It is not a raft. To make this boat go, you must row. If you stop rowing, the boat will just float and drift off. So drift is when it just like, sort of like moves really slow, you know, just sort of floats away, drifts away. That's why you need to have your oars or paddles to ra paddle with. This man rows with his left hand, then he rows with his right hand. He will just keep rowing. Soon his boat will pick up speed. Okay. This boat is a huge ship. It can take long trips at sea. If you were on this ship, you could eat, sleep, and play games on it. Would that be great? So I've never been on a cruise ship, but I've heard good stories. You can go, you can go there and eat at their buffets and play games and go to different lands and visit the, the ports and buy stuff. All right, let's look at our words and then we shall read it together. Okay.
we have a whole bunch of OA and OW words. Remember, OA and OW both spell the long O sound. So every time you see them, you're going to say O. So B, oat, boat. Snow, snow. Blows, blows. Slow, slow. Float, float. Loads, loads. Rowing, rowing, rowing. Great. This is one of our sight words this week. Great. And right. You just have to remember that I G H spells the long I sound. R right. Right. Like his right hand. Okay, now it's our turn to read. Together, I will try to read softer. Now what will happen, I wonder, if I turn on this light? Hmm, maybe that's a little bit better. It's snowing out there, and so it's really gray in front of this window. Okay, here we go. Are you ready? Boat rides. Is it time for a ride? A boat ride can be so much fun. This boat has sails as white as snow. The big white sails make the boat go. Wind blows and fills the sails. Strong winds can make the Boat go fast. It is fun to sail, but you must stay safe. You need a life vest. This flat boat has no sails. It is slow. You use a pole to make it float. It can carry loads down this stream. That flat boat is carrying loads of people. Now we're looking at these rafts. This boat is a raft. It is fun to ride fast on white waves. Hats and Life vests help keep this ride safe. Are you reading with me? The more you practice, the better you read. Ready? Go. This boat has no sail. It is not a raft. To make this boat go, you must row. If you stop rowing, the boat will just float and drift off. This man rose with his left hand. 
Then he rose with his right hand. He will just keep rowing. Soon his boat will pick up speed. This boat is a huge ship. It can take long trips at sea. If you were on this ship, you could eat, sleep, and play games on it. Would that be great? Okay, boys and girls, hope you learned to read some. You can always look at the link under this one in your Google Classroom classwork page, and it has the slides for this story. And you can practice it reading it two more times there without any help. To build your fluency. Can't learn how to read unless you practice. Bye-bye.